That's pretty good. That's good. Bro, That's yes, good. dude. Let's we go. Welcome back, guys, to the channel. Last week, I gave a little update on my bus, the situation at the mechanic with the bus, and I told you guys it's gonna be a little while until it's back in my hands, so I built this car camper instead. So today, before I head out on any sort of journey, I wanna put compartments in here, get this thing to where it's kinda of more livable. my cutouts here I think I'm gonna do three in here and four in here I'm not gonna glue them in or screw them in I'm just gonna put them in I'm gonna slide them in for the clothes drawer I'm not gonna divide that one into separate compartments I don't think I need to this will be separated enough socks and underwear like long pants t-shirts, blah, 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 I have plenty of room. The kitchen one though, that one's gonna be a little bit trickier. I'm going to divide this one into a few separate parts. I'm thinking I'm gonna put a divider here. So this will be tea and coffee in here. And then up in here, I think I'm gonna divide down here. So I have a good chunk of room here for like plates, bowls, and utensils. I think it'll work. I really do think it'll work. So I'm gonna go ahead and start cutting up some dividers for this. I like organization. I love organization actually. So um, <laughs> let's get into it. So, so good. Oh yeah, that's like, that's organization. That's, that's, Perfect. I think I'm gonna actually permanently put these in, not right now, but I think this is probably the configuration I'm gonna go with. Tons of room, honestly. Tons and tons of room. But I'm really happy with the way that turned out. That looks so good. You say it's been so fun. I ask about tonight. So, yeah. Uh, I, uh, I've been driving around the last few days now with these not in place. So I'm gonna put them in place today because obviously they all kind of fell out of place. And then we're gonna hit the road today and kind of do a little something out of here. I think I'm gonna cook some lunch. So I made everything half an inch shorter than the top of here. So I'm gonna get a half inch board kind of lay over top and pull out and put on top across this way uh, to have like a little cooking station, I guess. So we're all set and ready to go with the kitchen. Let's move on to the clothing drawer and then see what we can do today. drawers are good to go. They're all done and ready to go. The only other thing that I really have to figure out before I go on an actual camping trip is what I'm doing with these windows, man. I have like that Reflectic, uh, like that foil stuff. I don't really know what it is, like the bubble wrap foil kind of stuff. So I'm thinking I might, for the time being, until maybe I get them tinted or something, I might just cut out to each window some of that foil, some of that reflector stuff, and, and just throw that up at night and kind of cover up all the windows. But for today, I kind of have something else planned. All right, so this is my boy, Jesse. It's you guys might've seen him in a few videos in the past, but uh, yeah, we're gonna go on a little hike. I'm gonna make a little meal out of the, out of, I keep on wanting to say bus, but out of the car. 
I'm gonna make a meal out of my car. Should be a nice little fun time today. So Let's get it. Plan and you know it. Do the work for a rich That's man. Kinda nice. Turn in. I have a place to sit. Yeah. Those colors are popping. Let's go. Yeah, look at that. These rocks are tough. Nothing at all. All right, one last look. Before we head back and make some broccoli cheddar soup. Absolutely beautiful. Right, so like I said, uh, we're gonna make some broccoli cheddar soup. I love broccoli cheddar soup. It's one of my favorite soups and it's nice and cool out. It got a lot cooler than it was earlier. So we're gonna do a little kitchen thing. First time cooking out of the car. I find a lot of recipes on Pinterest, I can't lie. I got this one off Pinterest too, so I gotta kinda pull it up and see. Sometimes I just cook off the top of my head, other times I find recipes. This is one of those cases where I need a recipe. Smells good. This is a ah no, dude. Oh my lord, bruh. I got too excited. I want to die. I knocked it over. The solution for this coming up for future trips. It's good I'm doing this because I kind of work out the kinks of the car, right? So I think I'm probably gonna get like a table instead of doing this. But for now, this is a good enough solution. I'm just gonna get back to work cutting stuff up. Good thing it was on step one and not. The end of it so <laughs> actually maybe i should just get a better stove i could just get a better stove too that like sits flat you know yeah all right we're back we're to back it. we're back Let's in go. business baby <laughs> So I forgot to put the prongs out for, for the pot, so that's why the pot actually fell off. But I'm thinking I'm either gonna get a table or get a whole different cooktop, because this is like a backpacking kind of stove, so maybe like an actual stove with propane would be nice. But um, yeah, we're partway through making the broccoli cheddar. We just have a couple more ingredients, but we gotta let the broccoli kind of soften up inside of our mixture. But it smells phenomenal, so I think it's gonna be a good dinner. I don't know if that was recording or not, but we have our broccoli cheddar. It smells phenomenal, and we 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 killed it. We just we absolutely destroyed it. It smells incredible. Check. I mean, come on, check that out. You can't beat that. Oh baby. So excited. A little taste with fall colors, man. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's do it. Gotta get, make sure you, I was gonna say you gotta yeah. make sure you get broccoli. That's pretty good. That's good. Bro, That's yes, good. dude. Let's we go. That's good. Hey. <laughs> All right, guys. So I'm actually gonna put the recipe in the description of the video if you guys want to try it out. It's actually super fire, and it's super easy. One pot, super quick. Took us like what 20 minutes, maybe. Well, I also dropped onions <laughs> all over the ground, so I don't know, like 20 minutes and uh, out of the back of the car, so it's super easy, super simple to do. Yeah, <laughs> super good. It's fire. Super, it's super fire. good. Let's go. That's good, man. All gone, man. It was just way, way too good. Empty bowls. 
empty bowl. Yeah, the last two weeks, there have been so many new faces on the channel. So thank you guys so, so much for that. And if you are new here, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Uh, we're just working out the kinks on the car build. So I decided I am gonna paint the fronts of those. I am gonna put protective finish on them. That way everything is washable and cleanable. Um, but it's a good thing that I'm doing it like this and I didn't just go travel and I'm working out the kinks now. I think by next week, we're gonna be pretty good to go. And I think I have some good trips planned for you guys to come along on. So I'm super excited to do that. And if you're new to the channel, like I said, make sure you subscribe, leave a like and comment down below. And uh, yeah, that's gonna be a wrap. So without further ado, I'll see you guys next week. Peace. Oh,